use them that I like. Oh. Come wine for me, cocky till you feel better. Good morning, it's Irene family. Good morning, it's me for me. Baby girl is not in the back, it's just her car seat. I literally just dropped her off to daycare. <sighs> Honestly, y'all, I've been working, 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 like working, 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 working. So when I, by the time I come home, I'd be really, really tired. Um, so I think what I'm gonna start doing is trying to like really push out content on the weekends and stuff and just well, a lot of stuff is coming up. We got apple picking coming up. The biggie is here. Um, it literally starts today. We have fall pumpkin. I mean, fall. We have pumpkin patch. So we have some hay rub. We got a lot of stuff planned. Uh, obviously, weekend time. So be on the lookout for those vlogs. Those vlogs are coming. Today is going to be a personal self-care day. My hair look a mess, but I won't like that a little bit. I won't like that much longer. I have a hair appointment today. I have a dental appointment today. I'm going to get my eyebrows done. Um, I'm going to do laundry. Like, this is about me feeling good. You know, I have errands to run. And, yeah, so I am learning how to take a day to myself and not feel guilty about it because everybody knows i'm a 24 7 hands-on mom to be honest like i'd rather just be with kennedy and just bring her everywhere i go so i'm trying to get in the hang of even taking at least one day to myself which like is rare very very rare so i take a couple hours but a whole entire day like where she's at daycare the whole day like rarely i don't i barely ever do that so i'm just going to try to enjoy my self-care day just do things that make me feel good i might get a pedicure like you know what i'm saying just relax and just wind down and just do whatever irene wants to do so in this moment it's like 6 45 6 50 just dropped her off um, I'm going to go pick me up some breakfast. I made some curry crab legs. So in here is my friend's food. Um, we always give each other food. If I cook, she get food. If she cook, me get food. So that's all we do it in uh, where we're there, where we're from. You know, as all we Caribbeans do it. So I'm, that's what I made. I think I said that. But if I didn't, curry crab legs with some corn, some carrots. I, sh I was going to put some shrimp in there and I just was so tired. I didn't feel like stopping yesterday for the shrimp. I should have stopped for the shrimp because that shit, this, sh this shrimp would have just slapped the blood clot food. They get me I said, but whatever. So after I do that, that's when I'm going to go do the laundry just to get it out the way. I should be done, by the, done with the laundry by like. 8 30 9 o'clock to be the latest which will be good i'm just gonna go home drop it off and then i have my dental appointment at 9 30 hair appointment at 10 30 and then i also want to go furniture shopping because i am ready to get some new couches a whole new living room set in general my tv stand had broke from when we first moved in the apartment so it's just time for another one i want a really really nice i think i probably might order mine online because i want like a fireplace style i'm not sure which one i want that's just, that's what my mind is telling me but i don't know if that's what i true that's what I'm, i don't know if that's what my heart is desiring so i don't know y'all just stay tuned i'm gonna get some porridge because me love porridge i love me need some we need some good hearty breakfast so i want one porridge i want fried dumpling or some plantain and drop the food off go to the laundromat yeah so my morning is pretty packed it's my afternoon that's kind of like mm, kind of ain't really much to do so i might pick kennedy up early we'll see but this hair is getting tame so stay tuned my part is almost finished y'all can't even oh i spilled my shit so let me tell you what i had it's because my, my mother-in-law called me we was talking so I got some minicom porridge. I got some plantains or some plantains, I say. I made it up one fried dumpling with hot like a bumper clot rock. I rated it. My total breakfast together. I think we not minding my business. My clothes in the washer, by the way. I rate my whole entire breakfast an 8 out of 10 because my dumpling was hard as fuck and that shit pissed me off so now we're in usually i tip i did not tip this morning because i was very irritated like i can go in and i'm trying to order my food you're sitting on the phone and you're talking with the phone at your ears so how are you able to listen to what i'm ordering 
and also serving me at the same time while you're having a conversation i had to keep repeating myself that shit irritated me because why are you and I, I i stayed calm about it and i just said no tip i'm not about to tip you because you're not doing your job at full effect i have to keep repeating myself and you're on a phone call you don't think you tell your phone call, it's six o'clock in the morning who the hell you really there's no business that's open at that time in the morning so whoever you were talking to you could have said hold on or you could have said let me call you back let me get these customers out the way you decided to talk have me repeat myself a thousand and one times nothing to say so when i put my clothes in the in the, in the dryer stop and shop was around the corner i'm about to go to stop and shop i'm about to get me some meats like you know just to put in my freezer because i've learned that it's just easier for me to go get it when i need it like i don't know stuff will be sitting in my freezer or sitting in my freezer in my freezer i don't like that so today i mean i still have crab legs i made some curry crab legs. i told you that earlier right i think i did i still have some crab legs so i think i might and, and then i have the uh i don't know i'm gonna just get a bag of shrimp i'm gonna get me a steak and i'm gonna get me some chicken wings and then i'm gonna get kennedy some more um fruit baby food and because to be honest she's eating breakfast now I told you guys, like, I tried my baby on an egg. I made her scramble eggs. She did not like the eggs. Maybe because when I was pregnant with her, she made me throw up the eggs. I could not eat the eggs. Like, and even now as a kid, as a baby, she do not eat the eggs. Like, she did not like them fucking eggs. So, whatever. Um, usually when I make Kennedy's food, I freeze it. And it's usually the, like, by the time she goes to daycare, by the time it's time for her to have lunch, is the thawed and ready for her. So, because she has breakfast now... And I don't want it to be like frozen. I mean, I I could freeze and put it in the free in the fridge from the night before, but it's just easier for me just to give her. And I'm still trying her on different things. Like I'm trying her. I rather try her on the baby food before I actually make it, and that way I can know what she like and she doesn't like. Like the other day, I tried to give her some strawberries. It was strawberry apple. I think it was strawberries and apple. She did not want that shit. Like she kept spinning out. She did not like it. This is this. That's the second time I tried Kennedy on something with strawberries. She don't like strawberries, so whatever. So she like um like blueberries, wild berries, stuff like that. So now that she's at stage two, and as far as the food goes, I know she like her regular stuff, her apples, her pears, her bananas. So I got a whole bunch of those, and I just mix them in. Like I give her, I'll try her on one thing. If she likes it, then I'll mix them in and give her like you know a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And she be fucking up her food, y'all. She don't play about her food, so. We gonna go do that, y'all. So, let me go put my clothes in the dryer. All right, y'all. So, as you guys can see, that's where I stopped shop. Let me say what I got so far already. I got some pork ribs, some chicken wings, and some steak. Hands down, the best steak. So, we're at the baby aisle. Y'all know I only give my baby organic. Um, this is number two. So apple pumpkin and grown she has had all of these except for granola so i think i'm gonna try her on this this says banana cinnamon and granola i think i'm gonna just try her on this first so we're gonna get this oh oh i'm ashy she loves this apple wild blueberry she loves this my baby's a sucker for this so i'm gonna get her some of these because you know it's only organic and i'm thinking of trying her on apple spinach with kale i'm gonna get one of this just in case she don't like it this is the one she hated apple strawberry and bee i think it was i don't know if it was a i think i'm gonna just give her strawberry by herself by itself and see how she do with it because she was not she was not fucking with this one at all. This thing is so rude. Like, why would you turn on the owl, you know, in the owl? Are you trying to, like, that's crazy. And he coming closer to me. Oh, you about to attack me? What up, what up? Psych. So that is all I'm going to get. 
that's all I'm gonna get. So now I'm about to go to self checkout. I'm about to go pick up my clothes. Cause by the time I get there, the drive will be done. And then, yeah, I'm gonna drop these off and head off to the dentist. So y'all, I gotta tell you what happened with the other dentists, right? Okay, one thing about me, I have really, really, really bad like anxiety when it comes to like I don't. It might sound crazy because I had a whole baby and I didn't, but I you even can ask Kendall. Like I had an anxiety attack. Like I really struggle with certain things as far as anxiety. Like it really, it really just makes me my nerves like cringe and stuff like that. So what happened was, if you don't have your bumper clap fucking car. So, I'm, cause I'm annoyed, like, and people on the road driving dumb as fuck, like, drive your fucking mini coupe, bitch, and go. So, that's what I get for not going to who I always go to, cause honestly, guys, I did not even get a cleaning, I got the fuck up off that chair and I left. Okay, so, I have, I have, like, minor plaque, My, you know you get your cleaning, like, every six months to, I think it's, like, every six months, is it every six months for me? It's every six months, but the last time I got a cleaning, cleaning, cleaning... I don't even fucking it was last year so i have minor plaque or whatever so you know i told them like i have like i have anxiety like you know you're supposed to let people know ahead of time so they can kind of know what they're getting into and um it's like when i said that or whatever the fucking the first of all the way the assistant looked at me like bitch you 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 24 years old you got anxiety talking about you got anxiety with a dentist bitch i fucking do i don't i don't know it's like like the best way I could describe it is like it sounds like chalk chalk being written on the chalkboard like or like a marker being scraped or a fucking a fucking okay you're dumb as fuck like I just can't I need to calm down it is it, it, it like it reminds me of like I said either chalk I'm, I'm, I'm trying I'm trying to I'm trying to really really get like a good bitch is you going or what roll my fucking window up have to fucking really fight somebody in this bitch hold on let me park my car i hate coming to the ghetto i'm just aggravated nah let me tell y'all what it is so you ever heard like a fork being scraped on a bowl or like a chalk be chalk be written on a blackboard like my skin is literally crawling as we speak like my i'm goose bumping like that's how it makes me feel so it's like i can't control it like i start sweating like it just it's like it's, it really is a mind over matter thing but it's something that's difficult for me so i'm telling him like you know just and that you also is why i love where i go i just wanted to go somewhere as close to my house but i'm about to rate them a fucking negative one star because you weren't even patient like you was he was trying to like basically he was like he's like no let's just clean and that's it like he didn't even take the time the, the other person i go with he was like okay let's go let's work on let's let's clean let's work on another side another part like you know we will come back to this section or whatever like he works with like you could tell he has experience with people with fucking anxiety that shit pissed me the fuck i said you know what i don't even look i'm gonna get up like i wasn't even there for not even two fucking minutes i so i just set an appointment with my original dentist i'm gonna have to take, take that drive for the 25th or whatever and that's at four o'clock so yeah that shit pit yo that shit pissed me o f f fucking clean bro anyways i'm back at the hair store because i gotta get one more pack of hair and i might just get a milkshake for my troubles at this point because i'm just that shit pissed me off yeah i am back as you guys can see my hair is d-o-n-e my eyebrows are shaped up kennedy is right here mama kennedy look at her uh-uh hold your own bottle so I didn't go to the furniture store. I ended up finishing my hair late. Uh, I just got home, feeding, well, giving Kennedy her bottle. I'm about to eat the rest of my crab legs, and we'll probably go to the furniture store tomorrow. But this is this is just probably end up just being a hair vlog, I guess, because I'm about to wrap this video up. So don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell and drop against bangers. And don't forget to what did I say? Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I don't remember what I said, but just don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. I got a headache, y'all. So your girl is out. You want to say hi, mama? Yeah. Yay! Come here. You. Thank you. You want to say hi? Look at your hair. Show them how all your rubber bands pop. Say hi. Say hi, mama. See your teeth, see your girl. 
All right, ciao. You do the things them that I like. Oh. Come wine, for me, cocky, till you feel better. Yeah, you a champion, buddy, bro.